Shirley is here with the latest types of poinsettias for our holiday decorations. Shirley, I had no idea that all of these existed. I know, well, believe it or not, there's a hundred varieties, and I couldn't bring them all, but there's a lot of stuff going on in the world of poinsettias. Uh, right now, there's, as you can see, the iconic red. Right. That's never gonna go out of style. Gotcha. But there are so many different colors being developed. And actually, there's even a whole line of Thanksgiving poinsettias, believe it or not. Beautiful. And I'm gonna show you those in a minute. Okay. But I also got to trial a spring poinsettia. You're, you're gonna take a look at this. This is my garden. I got to trial these beautiful <gasps> pink poinsettias coming for Easter. What? So poinsettia, poinsettia, poinsettia. That's it's all your about garden, it right Shirley. Now. You are. Yeah. Amazing. I wouldn't expect anything less. Well, I mean, what am I talking you. about here? All right. Speaking of Thanksgiving, obviously yeah. it's coming right up. Let's start with the gold oh. rush. Okay. This stunning gold color, yellow colored poinsettia. It looks really tropical. It's it's called Gold Rush. Yeah. Good name. And what I love about it is it has all shades of yellow, from the little yellow, uh, light yellow, to the darker yellow, and then the little flowers here are going to come out in a very like almost an orange yellow but it's got the contrasting leaves it makes a beautiful display can you imagine this with pumpkins and the harvest Stunning. so it's perfect for thanksgiving but i want to show you how you can transition if you buy this one okay you may want to enjoy it for thanksgiving right how to transition it for uh christmas okay okay so the first thing we're going to use it as a cut flower and cam if you're not familiar with this once you take off the leaves because it's going in a vase it's got all of this, I'm gonna show the camera, it's got a lot of sap. It's got latex coming out of it. Oh, wow, and I wouldn't have you, guessed that. You see that, guys? Okay, that latex right there, if you don't get rid of it, it will pretty much damage the flower in water. So I'm immersing it, friends, oh. five seconds in very hot water. It's cauterizing it so that that sap isn't flowing anymore. What? Okay, so that's the first thing you're gonna do if you want to do cut flowers with poinsettia, any poinsettia. Great. Okay, now, I'll give you the honors to okay. put that into this beautiful well, vase. Thank you, Shirley. And then, of course, I said, let's make it more Christmas, right? Right. So let's add some berries. Great. Do I just put that in there? Yeah, anyway, just, you're not going to get it. You can't go don't wrong. Don't kill the plant. Well, I just, with. I mean, I knew it. <laughs> get I, it over as soon here. as I said I can't go wrong, I knew I'd get it wrong. Okay, right. good. What right in think? there like that? What do you think, Ken? Does that look like? That looks like Christmas. Thanksgiving transition into Christmas. Fantastic. Guess what? The next one is equally as stunning. It's called Orange Spice. Is that correct, Shirley? Absolutely. And you can tell when you see this and then you see the red that this truly is very orange. Yes. And what I like about it is that it's got these olive dark d green leaves that are pointed. Sure does. It really comes out in many, many different, almost like a sunset. Look at this leaf right here. Beautiful variegation. And so I want to show you how you can use this for your Christmas decor because it's Great. kind of like, you know, it's a, it's a little more on the Thanksgiving side. I so, love these tips. Yes, we have to take, you right. know, orange is very Thanksgiving, very fall, very right. end of fall anyway. Okay, but Beginning Cam, into Thanksgiving. I've got a new technique to teach you. Okay, let's see what we okay. got. Let's do so, this. So, if you don't want to do the hot water for some reason, and you like fire, yeah. you like fire? Wow, you got excited there, yeah. Shirley, jeez. A little bit, a little fun, right? <laughs> okay, check this out, friends. You're going to sear, just for a few seconds, don't kill it. And we're cauterizing it. That's so the and sap doesn't come out? That's so the sap doesn't come out. Okay, so we've got this ready. But Amazing. here's an idea, guys. Okay. Show us. Look how cute. Let's make this and use this for a gift topper. And this is what we're going to do. Do the honors and put this in. I'm going to show okay. you how to do it. All right. Oh, jeez. Just put it right in there. You got okay, it. Okay, friends, what you do with this, take a look at... This is one of these little water spouts that you use for a floral pick. There we you go. Know? So that is what this is. All I did was I got some of this moss that has the adhesive. Yes. And I wrapped it so you don't see it. And then, Cam, do the honors, please. Put that sure. on that gift. Look how beautiful. Imagine a, a giving a gift over the oh holiday season my. with that on there. Or <gasps> how about a place setting? Or even a place setting. Yeah, that would be gorgeous. It's surely so beautiful. Now, really quickly, how long do poinsettias last? Okay, if you do what I just told you, preparing it correctly, right. these can be in a vase and water for four weeks. So Christmas. Very good. And I can't. Which brings us to. We can't finish without talking yeah. about these. I like the colors in this one. Yes. It's amazing. This is called Country Quilt. Country Quilt. And it is a new Christmas variety. I'm saying new. It's been around for a few years, but okay. it hasn't been in wide distribution. And take a look at this. I mean, the leaves are have beautiful splotches. There's creams. There's yellows. But what I love, Cam. You tell me. Look at this leaf. What color is this? That's purple. It's like purple, right? That's amazing. And then there's also green. 
Awesome. You don't miss a beat in there. You see things I would never have seen. Okay, so, also we've got white and then we've got a unique uh -huh. red one down there too. Yes. Tell me about that red one. Okay, for those of you who are looking for something different, go for the winter rose. Yes. Look at that. And those are just the petals that ha are, are cultivated in a way so that they curl under. What? It's Awesome. So oh, there's man. somebody, so, something for everybody, right? Uh, amazing, Shirley. You brought, right. I know there's a hundred. You, you almost brought in that many. I'm yeah, almost. <laughs> for more information, go to hallmarkchannel.com and you can always visit edenmakers.com because Shirley is amazing. Oh.